I do a variety of things from uh, collecting data outside um, with various types of survey gear to, to bring that information indoors and sitting in front of my computer for a few hours and processing that information into something that's usable for clients. I've done lots of different things since I left uni, so I've started out doing some PhD work and I've worked in government and the private sector in a variety of roles. Um, I'm in the current role as a contractor because I'm a part-time stay-at-home mum with my son Patrick, so it's a good way to do some part-time work while staying involved with the industry and getting to stay home with my son. And some of the places you get to go as a surveyor are just incredible. Um, in the, my first year out of uni I got to, to do a survey of the Snowy Mountains Hydro Scheme about two weeks before snow season. So it was fairly cold but the scenery is just amazing. Um, and you get to go a lot of places that the ordinary public don't get to go just simply because of the nature of the job. Just recently we went out to Grantham after the flooding and collected information about the different flood heights around the town so that we can build a flood model so you know, in the event that future floods happens, we might be able to better predict how that water's going to behave. A wise person once told me that I should do what I love and find someone to pay me to do it, so I did just that. Um, I always enjoyed working with computers, but I also enjoy being outdoors and being in the surveying and spatial sciences gives you that perfect balance of the both. So um, I'm out in the field with you know, handheld computers and high-tech GPS gear and then I come back into the office and I'm you know, analysing and producing that data to a, a usable format for all sorts of purposes. Surveying is definitely not your typical IT career. Um, a lot of people don't even think of it in the IT sphere but we definitely have a lot of um, engagement in the IT type industry. A lot of the information we produce and collect is used across you know, any number of industries and it, with the IT influence we've got a good background in you know, systems administration and database design, but we also get to do a lot of cool stuff outdoors. My future in the industry, who knows? <laughs> five years ago I didn't know I'd be here, so in five years' time who knows what I'll be doing, but um, hopefully I'll be in a position where I can teach high school students and primary school students about surveying and spatial industries to engage them in the world around them and get them mapping as a hobby as well. Do it. <laughs> There's any number of um, paths you can take in the IT industry. Surveying is just one of them. Um, you know, surveying is across with the engineering field, so IT is not limited to your stereotypical computer geek. Um, there are lots of other things around that you can do in the industry that, that don't conform to those you know, nerd type ideas, I suppose. <laughs> Personally, the, I think that the benefits out of, of my job have been travelling to amazing places. I mean, I've got to travel overseas for work, so I've been to any number of countries and pretty much the people you meet 